Hello and welcome, I'm Arumba. Thank you for joining me. This is episode 110 for the Prince and the Thane mod. Let's continue. Alright, so I am pressing on all fronts a slow advance. I am trying to avoid attrition. Um, we've managed to end this war, so let's move on here. In fact, let's get our organizer buddy. Now you run that army down and then go there. They won't even consider running until we're one county over, and then as soon as they realize that someone's coming, they won't be able to flee. He is he's very fast. 16 martial movement speed is at plus 100%, double time. So, they can't flee. Somebody was imprisoned in combat. Did we get... Nope. Okay, this army now. Let's put the organizer down here now. And let's put Alex Rack. You can give. Why don't you take one of these flanks and actually do well with it this time, please? Don't disappoint me. I'll execute you. Supply limit's decent there. Can you catch him? 17th. Yeah, we can. We can catch him. We'll have that one go there, and this army can come in and take the place. We've got a nice little wall being built here. These aren't even part of the actual target, um, one of the war targets, but it's just safer to do this slow advance. I always try to create the duchies myself so that I have more control over what happens with them. I'm probably just going to give it to her or one of her vassals, but... It's also a great way to maximize score. Um, let's see. That was the Duchy of Vidin. Yeah, I'll just give it to her. Also, by creating it, she, you know, I get an opinion bonus versus her making it and no opinion bonus. So this is nice. We've got the uh, Sabahid Emirate and the Jaladin Sultanate fighting each other. To me, that word just looks like Aladdin. The Jalaladin. 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 Okay, so that one's down. This army... Let's just have them start walking. They can come in and support us along here. Actually, no. We'll have them go here. It's only 8,000 men, roughly, so we should be able to raise... Oh, shoot. Where are my boats? Okay, good. They're all here. Crap! <laughs> Suffering attrition just... Alright, I'm going to do this. Um, nope, combine again. New unit. And I want 5,000 unit. 5,000 unit detachments. There we go. There's one. You guys hop in the boat for now. We'll take 5,000 more. There we go. You guys can head to there. That's the reason why I'm trying for 5k. Another 5,000 unit detachment. Close enough. You guys can head to there. One more. Yeah, 
And I'll just try to split this one roughly in half. There we go. You guys can head up to there. You guys can head to, say, there. And the guys that I initially put on the boat we will send up to here for just a moment. We really don't need that many boats for this, but once they land, we're going to disband the boats, take these 5,000 men to there. Actually, let's... Let's go there. That's a capital. That should be worth something. And now that the boats have all been disbanded, um, I'm going to get, say... I'm going to get a little bit of boatage. A little bit of boatage. Up here for them when they arrive. And then we'll transport them that way. Unfortunately, these guys don't have quite enough. Just a little bit shy. Hmm. This army... Oh, let's break them up now as well. Oh, shoot. That's close enough. We'll have these 5,000 go to here. These 4,000 can help out here. I think that's going to be, yep, within the supply limit. Good, good. About to siege this. Capturing people is always good. More money. If you don't have money, then you die. And I hope I didn't just ransom this guy that I could have and forced to... Yeah, shoot, I did. Well, we're going to win anyway, I think, but... I guess at least this way we get some money. Would have been better, I think, to end the war, though. My mistake, I should have checked these before going to do ransoms. Okay, we've got a good wall. And actually, I think instead of going down there, I don't want to deal with their, their army, actually. Let's do this. I'm going to shift you guys here. No. I'm going to shift 4,000 of you guys. Send you guys to there. And then instead of having that army go there, we'll have it go there. Because this army, this one can hold 5,000. We'll lose a couple hundred men to attrition, but I don't want to engage him if I don't have to. I just want to just be this monstrous wall of men sieging every county along the border. Take 4,000 men to there. Let's just combine that and then split it again. enough. You guys can go to here. Why don't you follow the coast, though? We'll split this into roughly about 5,000. Yeah, looks like it's about as close as it's going to get. You guys can go there, and you guys can go to here. Although I don't like that pathing. Go there, and then here, and then here. Actually, don't even do that. The one that's going down there, just hang out for a second.
Okay. You guys are almost there. I think we took care of everything up this way. It's just I'm just checking around, make sure I didn't miss any armies. Now we started again with like 180,000 men. We're at down to about 130, plus 50,000 men already. It's a lot of men for the Middle Ages, you know? It's nice of them to sacrifice their lives for the good of England, Great Britain. And now we wait. We've got our line of attritionless armies, which is good. These guys should probably... Can they go here? Yep, join that army. Want a battle over here. He's going to squat now down on that. Good, good. Somebody sieged my holding. We should have an army take care of that soon. We'll go there because that's 8,000. Perfect. Good, good, good. Get rid of these boats now. And this is how... Now what is up with this? Oh shoot. Damn. He's reunited his realm. Now we're suffering more attrition than before because of hostile holdings. Shoot, I just had them all perfectly spread out. Damn it, you little bastard. Okay, fine. Let's just start shifting inward. You guys can go to here. Can you cross here? Looks like you can. I've just got to force it. Alright, fine, okay. You guys go there. You guys can go there. You guys head to there, you guys head to here, and you guys can head through to Sinar, you guys head through to there, you guys don't even care, just go rally there. That is really annoying, all that work, all that management, micromanagement, <coughs> you can see now, a long time ago when I had the Holy Roman Emperor and the Byzantine Emperor doing my battles for me, winning wars, how I said it's, it's really nice when uh, you have allies to just take care of the war for you and like make it happen. Because you don't have to do any of the micro. It's just automatic. And let's get some more retinue. Want my courtier? Sure. Just leave me alone. Son was born. You named him Alex Rack. That's very creative, Alex Rack. <laughs> Smart man you are. You want a marriage again? I already gave you a husband. <coughs> Don't marry the King of Brittany. Just get out of here. I don't care. I want you to leave my realm and never return.
Now come help me. <laughs> Brittany. We lost a battle here. That's rather annoying. He is heading to Sinjar. So we will support Sinjar. Just lost a thousand gold. Awesome. That was a misclick. That shouldn't have happened. That was stupid. Come on. Stupid attrition making it so annoyingly difficult to get enough men to actually have a good fight. God, it's retarded. Well, we've just sieged something, so hopefully that's another 100 percenter somewhere. No? Damn. These deserts are just brutal. 2,000. Ugh. winning against this guy is because he has not lost enough land yet. Obviously. Oh, I have no money. Funny, funny, funny. Okay. I'm not too concerned about these. Okay, there's another one down. Time to press forward with the Holy Order. Good job, Holy Order. But you go now, and I remember this big, huge chunk I was actually going after. 6k is probably the best supply limit you're going to get, so do what you can. Other than that, this 4k can head to here. That's fine. We'll hold on to these titles for now. I'm not going to give them away yet. <coughs> oh, we can create a kingdom of Kiva now. That'd be nice. We actually had some money. I hadn't lost a thousand gold to events because I'm dumb. I don't make mistakes. It never happens. Why are you guys alone? There should be a wall. Don't you understand? This one little stack of 3,000 men is just consistently slaughtering my armies because we have no commanders because they're not appointed automatically and I can't be bothered to do it every single time and because I can't get together a reasonable army to face them because of attrition ah oh and then of course the fact that I have no money there's always that perfect timing can we ransom some people? Can we murder somebody? Can we do something? I need money. Pogrom, maybe? Pogrom. We gain nothing. Okay. Try not to rage quit. 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 Go away. You're only engaging me because you know I have no morale. You, you are terrible. Where's my organizer? Don't tell me my organizer died. There's one. Get out of there. Quick. Good. Go join up with that army. Or don't. Just go there and then go there. The liege loyalists are getting dangerous. That's funny. Ugh. I'm wondering, I'm starting to wonder if I overest if I underestimate this damn desert again.
We propose that they marry matrilineally. Um, the king of Jerusalem wants to marry somebody to my sister matrilinearly. Alright, that's fine. Get out of here. Go away. We need money. Give me money. Can I imprison somebody? I need some money. Okay, I have to wrap this one up here. I look forward to seeing you again in the next video. See you soon.